Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, uh, well, while looking through Windows 10, I've been playing around with it because I noticed that the um, SSD health status on Windows 11, which is a cool feature that has uh, Windows 11, uh, is not available in Windows 10, which is uh, sad. So you do have to download a tool. But while doing that, <laughs> a few things caught my eye. One is that in the Settings app, when you go to um, the system, on the bottom left, you have optional features. And I don't remember seeing this in, um, in Windows 10 for some reason. Um, so you've got the optional features, which are features that you can add or remove from, from Windows 10. Uh, here's an example, Internet Explorer 11, which technically should be gone. But um, And another one that is, uh, so of course there are system components that now have been pushed to a different uh, area. So there are a few changes that have been happening in Windows 10 in the last few um, months because these are some of the options I don't remember seeing. I also noticed that um, the uh, operating system puts a dot here because it wants you, it says restore recommended. And you look at it and it says, oh, you got to set Microsoft Edge as your default browser and also set Bing as your default search engine. Please confirm. It's like, uh, no. So <laughs> I, I had not noticed also that it annoys you to let you know that you've changed some of these defaults. So it's a minor annoyances, but a few things that um, didn't ca catch my eye at first. So there's a few little things like that in the settings that are kind of uh, interesting. But uh, like I said, I was looking through the, um, the storage, and uh, here in the storage you don't have... Uh, you don't have any advanced options in storage. There's some options, but um, I haven't seen any advanced options to uh, to check for health, um, the health status of the drive. So it's, it's sad because it would have been fun to have that feature, at least that feature, within. So this brings up legacy stuff and uh, backup options. Yeah, no no uh no ssd no ssd uh health status unfortunately which would have been really really nice so these are a few observations of windows 10 22h2 right now um a few things i had not noticed before hey, if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching